Today we're out on a little back road adventure. We've got Kyler with us and uh, hopefully we'll both keep uh, the rubber side down. A little silty sand there, buddy. This is Forest Road 616, and this will take us around the east side of Sedona, and then we'll we'll head up on the rim. I forget what the Forest Road number is. That'll take us up into Pines. Lots of pedestrians through here. take a right before we get to 17. I need to get my cardio in.
little canyon over here if you're interested. It's a little side trip. Wow, this is a new tower and everything. Uh, it looks like a repeater for um, DPS, state troopers. Why do I? Ah, yeah. uh, I just, that's my thing. You grow up off road? Uh, for a period of time, I lived in New England, and by the time I was 18 or so, most of the places that you could ride were uh, off limits. So I transitioned to um, street for a while, and when I got moved out here about 20 or so years ago, I uh, went back to dirt. Cool. Yeah, this canyon, there's a back trail. Um, I camp over by Apache Maid, and there's a trail that you can come down and hit it at different points. And on that eastern end of the canyon, this is West Clear Creek, there's a, a hiking trail that you can take, and there's several waterfalls that you can go in and stuff like that. Really? Yeah. That's yeah, kind of a neat little area. Oh, um, four-wheel drive magazines in the beginning, um, a couple people that I rode with, uh, Google Earth and all that kind of stuff. Just, you know, uh, being curious about a trail, so I'll have my GPS on, I'll go down the trail and then swipe that into Google Earth and see where the trail goes. <laughs> This is uh, Coconino National Forest. So if you take a, a left here, it'll take you by, yep, Stoneman Lake first, that's got no water in it. That'll take you up by Mormon Lake, and then Lake Mary. Yeah. sneak in here somewhere uh, right here this could be a little chewed up but we'll take our time it's 
Some of it, yeah. This might be a little bit... That's not bad. Look worse than it was. Wow, no, no, no motorized vehicles, but you can run your AK over there. Yeah, statewide, shooting ban. <laughs> well, you're not supposed to do that. You'll burn the state down. Yeah. So this is uh, T-Bar Ranch. It's actually, I think, on the historic register. Oh, really? But yeah, there's, it was, uh, I think 1870s, 1890s, something like that. It was a horse ranch. Started out with this little piece in the front and built out back. Over there, there's a um, root cellar, like a pantry, and then the root cellar is starting to collapse. Why is this one protected? Um, just a historic property. Just because it's around? Yep, and I think they decided to put some protection on it just because things up here get torn down and beat up and oh. you've got pictures of the people that lived here <laughs> I guess yeah yeah it's, it's, it's got to be close to the century right because if it were yeah from what I understand that, then... after 1900 it was like I don't know if it was a dude ranch or like a boys camp something like that okay. You know, like, yeah, like it's... That's know, like 1920s, something like that. Which is, the crazy part for me is you consider what life was in America in 1902. Right. Cowboys. Yeah. And then across the ocean, civilization. Right. Wearing two-piece suits. Yep. Well, me more than that, probably four-piece, three-piece suit, you know, like doing that whole thing. They got kitchens and... When I first started coming out here, that was still no up, kidding. and uh, a snow collapsed it. But it's it's worse than what I saw before. You used to be able to see the foundation a little bit better and stuff. But yeah, she's starting to go. But yeah, you put all your root vegetables in there and stuff like that. You were eating stuff. Absolutely. Yeah, I can imagine sitting out here, you know, having a little brewski, watching the cows. <laughs> what is life? Literally don't talk, don't see anybody for weeks. Yeah. Life's different now. That's the lookout we're going up to. No kidding. Yes, dude. I love this. <laughs> yes, this is what I was after. Just, just let me just follow you. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh man. I'm going to, I believe this will take us around this left. Yeah. If it's not, that's just a forest road sign right yeah so we should be able to go through here it'll drop down into the into the creek there and it'll yeah. take us out onto the main road to get up to patchy made it's a switchback road that goes all the way up paved oh uh, no dirt i uh, love them i, I was all and it, it's just uh psychological but uh I always used to think that the stock mirrors with the uh, 
metal bar there was going to end up in my chest if I crashed. <laughs> Yep. up here. I saw the big red sign and I was thinking that it was... Oh, there's a padlock on it. The other side of the fence. I think they got a new... Oh, COVID. I bet you. Uh, I got a face condom. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, we'll part, pull, do this pull off right here. Sedona's right over there. Right over there, that's the canyon that we were looking over. And we came right up on the other side of this ridge here. That's where we came up, we came all the way around there all the way back this way and then switch back up the hill. Can't beat it. It's free. Yeah, free. Hey. yeah I, they're saying that it's just bad air, but I think we're getting the smoke from California and all the other fires. Absolutely. Uh, Sideline images of it just swirling like a hurricane. Yep. Yep.
nice, huh? We're gonna sneak in this little turn out here. So you could camp right here. There's spots just like this all along the way. You could just ride your bike up, pop a tent right there, and have the best view in Arizona. We are, um, well, you see this is a muggy on rim, and we are uh, directly north of Payson. You know where that is? Yeah. So if you keep going on this uh, 300 road, it'll take you out to the 260 just north of Payson. Yeah. This is where I gotta go. <laughs> exactly. Thanks for watching. Thank Tyler for riding along with me and pulling, putting up with all my bull crap today. Please comment, subscribe, ding that bell so you get notified when I put up new videos. Like and share. Adios. Ooh, truck in the middle of the road.